Hello everybody. Hey, I just wanted to clarify some stuff because I got a lot of questions after the booster video uh, on how to burn stuff. Uh, so I just wanted to kind of show you in a couple examples uh, how to create a frequency uh, card uh, of your own. And in this example, I, what I'm doing is I'm actually going to do an upgrade. So to give you an idea how to do that, um, here's my my testosterone card okay this is one of the five boosters um, in the men's booster okay so it's this has got all the men's stuff in it right and what I want to do is I want to upgrade the frequencies and there's a list of uh, supplements that are in this frequency right now this this set and I'm gonna upgrade it now because I've just been able to and thanks to uh, uh, you know Jack for sending me some uh, really great frequencies to kind of mix into what I'm doing but he's actually sent me um, the actual frequency of testosterone uh, that you would get as an, an injection uh, you know if you were taking testosterone treatments and then also uh, I'm going to be adding a couple of su new supplements uh, one's called Tonkat Ali and the other one's Cordyceps which is a mycelium uh, which are really really good for men so basically taking a really good card making it better by adding three new frequencies to it so how do you do that of course and here's a blank card so how the main the first thing you want to do and this is what's important that kind of wasn't covered in Philip's video when he did the frankincense watch thing was if you have a source right and you don't want that source to pick up any frequencies from like let's say anything else you you put in uh, in that example he used frankincense and a watch and he put it in there and everyone was saying well doesn't the frankincense then pick up the frequency of the watch or ie the metal of the watch and the answer is yes so now in order now if you plan on actually taking this later like you don't want to throw it away because it's expensive then all you need to do is you just take it and you put it in uh, the Q block and you can put it in there for uh, one one or actually 30 seconds to transfer the frequency or what I do is three minutes to just basically transfer the frequency and then fill it up with quantum energy burn it to the max once you fill it up with quantum energy it can't take on any more so it won't take on like when I put that in with this metal card this aluminum card it won't pick up the aluminum from this card so then I'm feel I'm free to just go ahead and take it like a regular supplement after I'm done using it so that's the first thing you want to do is you want to take your source if you plan on ingesting it and you don't want the frequency of aluminum to be in your vitamins right or your supplements then go ahead and charge up your supplements first okay and then and then then move on to your next step but what I do want to point out too though and you obviously know it that I've got two different supplements in there and now they're transferring their frequencies back and forth to each other which is no big deal because I'm going to take them together all right so now the alarm's gone off I've taken the supplements out so now what I've got all right is I've got two different supplements and a frequency of testosterone and what I'm going to do now is I'm going to add that to my master card uh, of the testosterone so this is the original master card that's got all the testosterone uh, you know boosting uh, supplements in it so it's this guy right here real important not to mix them up so I take this guy and this guy's already he's basically a frequency source alright so I put him in here and I'm kinda just arranging stuff so I don't forget and now here's the new stuff I'm adding okay so I'm adding all of these new frequencies in <laughs> and they roll around Normally I just use like a paper towel or something. So now I've got the, the, the stuff I want to add. So there's three new frequencies and the old frequencies. And what am I going to add it to? This blank card. So I'm going to go ahead and just put the blank card in there. Try not to forget which one's which, guys. And then three minutes, boom, hit the, hit the timer. And then in three minutes now, what I'm going to have is I'm going to have a brand new testosterone booster card that's got three new frequencies in it. And that's it to how to upgrade so then that will be the upgrade card and this one will be the old one right with the less than three this will be plus the new three and that's it that's how you create an upgraded frequency card you you can't you can't upgrade the card that's the key thing that won't go anywhere you have to create a new one and that becomes your upgraded card there you go three minutes and I'm done and there you go I've taken the old testosterone booster I've added new sorts a new frequencies to it and now I have a new testosterone booster and a booster and I'm just labeling it new so I don't forget which one's which and now this is my new 
my new testosterone booster. So if I ever were to make a completely new men's booster, I would use this guy. I've also done this with the anti-aging booster inside the men's. So I'm sort of working on like a new version of it. But in the meanwhile, I'm just doing like little simple upgrades, which is, you know, a no-brainer. All right. So the next example I want to give you is how to upgrade your power capsule. If you have a heel or a men's booster capsule and you want to upgrade it, uh, there's two ways to do it. And if you have a Q block or an infinity block, that's the easiest way. So now these are the two additional uh, supplements that I have added to my anti-aging booster inside my men's booster and I'm sorry it's confusing uh, but I basically just recently added spermidine uh, and thanks to uh, someone out there in, in telegram world for sending me this it's pretty cool I mean anyway I don't want to get an anti-aging <laughs> uh, and HGH okay so this is like stem cell therapy another individual sent me this so you know kudos to you guys I want to say thanks for you know sending me these incredible frequencies so uh, so now I've got two new frequencies. I've actually already burned a new anti-aging booster card. Uh, and so that's done already, just like I just showed you. But now what I want to show you is now how would I upgrade my men's booster capsule with these new frequencies, right? Uh, and so it's really quite simple. Here are uh, the two spermidines, right? So this is two. And, I'm, and you know, and the reason I picked two is I just simply go by whatever the bottle says. If the bottle says one serving's one or two, I just, that's what I use when I put it in. That's just what I did. So I've already charged these guys for three minutes, so they're fully charged. So they won't take on the frequency of anything else you put in there. So the first thing I want to do is in order to upgrade your capsule, uh, you want to put in your source frequencies, fully charged, right? So there's the source frequencies for the upgrade of the anti-aging. And then as I just showed you, here's the source frequencies, testosterone themselves, uh, cordyceps and Tonkat Ali supplements. And there's the upgrade frequencies for the testosterone booster in the men's capsule. Here's the upgrade frequencies for the anti-aging booster in the men's capsule. And then I cut up a bunch of little tiny pieces of foil. There's like, I don't know, just a bunch. And I put them in there and hopefully the wind doesn't blow it away. And what I'm going to do is put that in there for three minutes. Uh, 30 seconds to burn the frequency. You know, it pretty much sets in there in two minutes. Uh, three minutes is tops. But bottom line is now what's going to happen is the frequencies of the testosterone upgrade and the anti-aging upgrade are all going to burn onto those little pieces of foil and I'm going to use that to add it to my men's capsule. As simple as that. And to upgrade your capsule, now this is my men's capsule which is my own creation, uh, my men's booster because I already had the frequency. Uh, so when Layla Q came out, and this is like the Layla Q, you can see the difference uh, of you know their men's capsule and their heel capsule are these bigger guys. Um, and so when they came out, I already had the frequency, so I went and bought a capsule, and anyone can do this. If you have a frequency um, and you have a Q block, go ahead and get your own capsule. Uh, and, uh, and I went with brass, and so these are brass with titanium spheres. And so this is my, my version of the men's capsule, and all you do is you just take one of those little pieces of foil now every one of those foil right these pieces of foil have the frequencies of the additional supplements for the anti-aging and testosterone and then I've just put it all in a, in a piece of foil and I add it to the capsule and that's it and then it's it's in there for uh, and now it's part of the men's capsule or my men's capsule and so now I've quote upgraded it it's as simple as that and so once you do that and you add the foil in there now all of the other foil uh, frequencies of the men's booster is, is burnt into the capsule shell and then the, the additional frequencies are now in the foil and I've just upgraded my men's booster and that's how you do it that's the one way uh, I'll show you the second way so the second way to upgrade a capsule uh, is really quite simple you can if you don't have a cube block you can use the spheres in your capsule they have enough quantum energy to actually transfer a frequency uh, from a source to a piece of foil. So what you need really is you need your heel capsule or you could use your men's capsule or woman's capsule, but you need to get the spheres out. And there's two things you're going to need, or three, right? Uh, you want to get like a three by three inch little piece of foil where you're going to wrap the spheres inside and create kind of like a little Hershey's kiss. So the easiest way to do that is I just kind of 
well it's kind of hard with one hand but I'm gonna just kind of show you where you put all five inside the foil and you make like a Hershey's kiss out of it I'm gonna show you in a second uh, it's impossible to do with one hand and once you have this little packet you've got this tight little packet of titanium spheres with quantum energy in it and it has enough energy to then burn uh, a source frequency into a target object or in this case the targets gonna be this piece of foil so uh, I would basically and I'm gonna cut this up and, and wrap it around a sphere but basically I will fold this foil up and I'll show you here um, and then I'm gonna use that and I'm gonna burn the frequency of and in this example I'm gonna use the weight loss card so I'm gonna use the Layla weight loss oh, sorry Layla weight loss card uh, this is a great frequency by the way uh, and so this is their new weight loss uh, frequency and you could take the frequency off of a card and add it to a capsule okay so then you could upgrade your capsule so what I'm gonna do next is I'm gonna off camera I'm gonna go ahead and and bunch this up into a tight little Hershey's kiss packet with the spheres inside and I'll show you how to do it okay real quick uh, what you want to do is if, uh, if you can see that it's four on the bottom and the fifth one in the middle on top of it and that's how you form your little pyramid okay so now what you want to do is now that you see this like you can see the outline of the balls right the spheres and so now I've got this little quantum energy packet um, and I, it's got enough strength as I said so you take your source and this source could be an essential oil drop you put right there on top of the foil it could be uh, you could put some powder in there like if you want to do like vitamin C or an herb or anything anything you put on top of this thing and then you put the packet on then three minutes later it's gonna it's gonna it's gonna uh, basically burn in there so what you want to do is I want to basically put the frequency which is on the card on top of the foil and then put the packet on top now the packet energy is going to go through the frequency card into that foil and you want to do that for um, I'm going to check the time and then and verify that with you in a second all right my bad it was not 20 to 30 minutes according to Phillips video so if you want to you want to take that packet and leave it on the card to burn the foil right the frequency of the card which would be this card into the foil 30 minutes so 20 to 30 I always go with the higher number so uh, it's definitely not three minutes that's if you're using the Q block all right so my bad so you want to burn or let it sit let this packet sit on the card 30 minutes then you take that little piece of foil that's under the card which has now got the weight loss frequency in it or whatever card you're using right and then you would then take that little piece of foil from this guy that you burnt the frequency into using the packet the little kiss the Hershey's kiss and you wrap it around one of those purple spheres and you put it in your heel capsule and there you go you just upgraded your heel capsule with the weight loss frequency and and that's the other way to do it so you can easily move frequencies between uh, you know sources and uh, and add it to your capsule or you know whatever uh, you want to add it to by simply using foil uh, you know for capsules and things like that so this is your other way to upgrade a capsule there you go and uh, I hope you uh, found this uh, helpful Aloha